In a recent video, I mentioned there are four key pillars of a political campaign. Your campaign message, how you execute it, your strategy, and how you outsmart your opponent. This is the first of two videos on executing your message. There is the what you say and the what you pay to say, otherwise known as advertising. Today I'll talk about the words that come out of your mouth. You will need to give speeches. You may have to debate your opponent. You will be expected to conduct interviews with newspapers and perhaps radio and television stations. And unless you are paying for the campaign out of your own pocket, you'll need to meet and speak with campaign contributors. These are items only you can do. They cannot be delegated. The words that fly off your lips can make or break your campaign. You are the star of your own play, the main attraction in your own movie. You must look and sound the part, for if you want voters to listen to you, you must look like you are worth listening to. You must therefore be well-rested, well-dressed, well-groomed, well-read, well-briefed, well-prepared. Your supreme obligation is to play well the part only you can play, and for most that's a full-time job. There is an art and a science to practicing for a speech, an interview, or debate. How to pivot off a difficult question to a topic that gets you votes. Knowing what you're going to say during the first two minutes of an interview, regardless of the question that is asked. How to control your body language and keep your cool in the face of hard questions. How to leave your opponent playing defense during a debate. How to use a news story to offer the perfect soundbite during an interview. How to read an audience during a speech. All require preparation, research, and rehearsal time, something all smart candidates set aside time to do. If you're looking for help in your campaign, visit my website at jtownsend.com. I'm Jay Townsend.